Physical remnants tell the tales of past civilizations in their most pragmatic sense, but it is the art that shines light into how life actually was. For the Hellenistic era of Greece, vase paintings were among the most foundational methods of artistic expression. Regarding their construction, Greek vase paintings can be separated into three distinct categories, black, red, and white. The symbolism of these vase paintings often depict Greek mythology as well as cultural motifs of the time. During the Hellenistic era, artisans created ornate paintings on fine pottery. These ornate paintings required immense skill. So having such painted vases were often displays of wealth and power. One of the most quintessential vase paintings of the time was of Ajax and Achilles playing a game of dice. These vase paintings were tributes to other finer pieces of Greek art, such as Homer's classic, the Iliad. Despite belonging almost exclusively to the upper class, painted vases contained lots of pragmatic purposes. Many vases that have been discovered offer simple paintings that depict images such as water, bath, or libation, and these vases would have been almost used exclusively for their respective paintings. At the time, vase painting was a relatively new trade, and the earliest techniques used to paint these vases were called black and red painting. Black and red paintings are inverse techniques of one another. Black paintings depict the figures in black against a red, clay-colored vase, while red paintings depict the artwork as clay-colored against a black-colored vase. Clay was the foundational building block for these vases, so the use of black dye to create images came about first. It was only after these techniques were in practice that artisans realized that they could add purple pigments to the clay before firing it in the kiln to create black faces. After these idea, ideas came about, artists experimented with other colors and could create a variety of colored vases. But the only other common vase color that has been found is white. Black painting depicted a more frightening, warlike sensation, and most paintings that revolved around Greek soldiers were constructed using the black painting method. The use of red paint allowed artists to construct more naturalistic depictions of emotions, as well as realistic anatomical figures. In these ancient times, gender was clearly distinguished in the vase paintings. Women were often painted using white colors, while men were typically shown in black. Painting constituted a majority of the art on most faces, but incision was another technique that was vital to artists of the time. Incision is essentially the skill of small cuts, but incision gave way to highly precise details that small brushes simply could not provide. Incision is one of the most important techniques that allowed artists to create these ornate vases. Due to the feebleness of other materials such as wood or paper, the strong clay-made vase offers some of the only insight into art and daily living of the Hellenistic era, simply because of their durability. Greek vase painters employed various techniques to create their vases, but incision along with black and red painting techniques were among the most prevalent. Though painters often depicted symbolic motifs, many vases were used simply for pragmatic purposes and uses.